Question to Professor Craig. Yes. Uh, well, I'd like to clarify some of those words so uh, we don't uh, create more trouble. Uh, I thought the debate was against Christianity versus naturalism, and I heard you give evidence for Christianity, uh, Dr. Craig, and, and, uh, and uh, Dr. Hardin give evidence uh, for science. But I'm concerned about this word naturalism and the audience understanding it. And perhaps I can uh, give an example and ask you to respond to it, if I might. Mm -hmm. uh, the 1995 position statement from the National Association of Biology Teachers stated that all life on Earth was the result of evolution, defined as an unsupervised, impersonal, unpredictable natural process. Now the question is, is that statement science, or is it naturalism masquerading as science? Thank you. Yeah. Well, I think that it is clearly uh, naturalism insofar as it says that the process was unsupervised and, what was the other word, unplanned? Uh, Impersonal. Imp Impersonal, because, un unpredictable natural process. Yeah, insofar as you say it's unsupervised and, and impersonal, that is implicitly making a metaphysical statement that there is no God who's beyond it. And it seems to me that science uh, cannot make that statement, and therefore that statement is a naturalistic statement. It's an expression of a philosophy. And uh, I appreciate the point that you're making is that it is not Christianity versus science. I mean, on the contrary, I've tried to appeal, at least in two of my signposts, to science to point in the direction of a transcendent ground. But, but this, this statement by the National Association of Biology Teachers was, as you know, I think, revised precisely because they realized that it was making a metaphysical uh, statement that went beyond the bounds of what science would allow one to say. On, on the basis of science alone, you could not say that it was unsupervised and impersonal. So you're very right to draw attention to the fact that we're comparing here two philosophies, naturalism and theism. That's, that's where the debate lies.